So, Floyd Mayweather is suing Miss Jackson. Um, you know, she's with Nelly now. He's basically saying that she stole money from him when they were in a relationship. Let me just say something. <sighs> Floyd, even if someone stole money from you, which I'm sure people are stealing from you, you probably don't even know who the fuck it is. For the simple fact that just the other day, they said Floyd, I read somewhere, it was a headline somewhere, that he went to China or somewhere, and he said that he brought like 25 people with him. Who the fuck goes, leave, goes out the country and just says, tells 25, girl, how you even know 25 people? Bitch, I barely know five. But see, that's what happens when you're rich, girl, everybody want to be your friend. So, girl, I'm sure people are stealing from you, and I'm probably sure that Mr. Jackson probably stole. Let me just say something. If I was Miss Jackson, would I have been putting money to the side? Absolutely. Sure would have. You know you were the psychotic motherfucker. You know that it's gonna it's not gonna last too long. So you may, may want to set yourself up. You know, so when this relationship ends, you got a little stash on the side. Was she taking money? Probably so. He said that Miss Jackson was a person who knew about his knew his credit card accounts and you know, where he kept his loosely organized cash. This is what I read on the, on the jasminebrand.com. Girl, how can you have loosely organized cash and it comes up missing? Girl, it must have not been organized too well. I don't know. But like I said, but at, the, at the end of the day, if I was Miss Jackson, would I have been probably taking a couple of dollars here and there? Probably so. I'm not even going to sit here and lie. Probably so. The nigga is slow. He probably ain't going to probably ain't gonna realize it anyways. It's 50 motherfuckers around. So, girl, who just going to point to the girlfriend? If anything, I'm going to go in there and suck his dick and give him some of this good badge and make him believe that one of his homeboys stole it before they try to convince him that I stole it, which I probably really did, but I'm not going to let them, I'm not gonna let them convince him of that. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, was she, was she taking some money here and there? Probably so. I don't blame her. Do I consider it stealing? No, not really. You know what it is? Floyd's still mad because uh, uh, Miss Chantel killed those babies. She killed those twins. Now, I'm pro-life and pro-choice all 100%. I swear to God, when I heard about her having that abortion... It honestly made me have a little bit more respect for her. Hear me out. I know some of y'all not anti. I mean, I know some of y'all are anti-abortion, anti-choice. <laughs> for a woman to get pregnant by a by a man like Floyd Mayweather, most people just would have saw dollar signs. A trifling bitch like me a couple of years ago, it wouldn't have been no doubt in my mind I would have had that baby. Boy or girl, baby, I would have named that baby Floyd Mayweather Jr. I don't give a fuck. Twins, Floyd Mayweather Jr. the first, Floyd Mayweather Jr. the, uh, I mean, the, the, the second. I love it go. Both of y'all names Floyd. But for a woman to have an abortion by a man where she could have been just racking in coin after coin after coin after coin, especially in child support, for a bitch to get an abortion, that lets you know that nigga had to be crazy. Now, some people are saying that, oh, you know, he beat her ass after he, after he found out that she had the abortion. No. 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 That shit been going, what's been going on. Ain't no woman. If you really and truly showing a woman that you love her and you care about her, she's not going to turn around and get pregnant, especially by no multimillionaire and then have an abortion. That don't even sound right to me. No, Floyd was kicking off in her ass way before she had that abortion. And that's what made her get the fucking abortion. Because she thought about, you know what? I'm not, I didn't sign up for this. I did not sign up for this. The only thing I signed up was for bags, shoes, trips around the world, and money. That's it. I didn't sign up for no babies. Especially not with no crazy nigga. A nigga who dropped out of school in the eighth grade. Girl, they said Floyd dropped out of school in the eighth grade. I don't know. I can believe it, though. Floyd, leave that girl alone. You are still mad about Miss Chantel not want to be with your ass and killing them babies. Let me stop saying killing them babies. You still mad at Miss Chantel for, for having an abortion and not want to be with your ass. They say he broke over her, but girl, I don't know, child. 
Um, leave Miss Chantel alone. Miss Chantel, Chantel got her a good man, Nelly. I don't think they have no issues. But y'all saw how Miss Chantel was on that bus the other day, though. You know, they said that Nelly had raped that little girl. I ain't gonna say little girl, but he he raped a woman, a young lady, uh, someone. But she wasn't like a little girl, but. Um, but Michelle, Miss Chantel said, you got me fucked up. I'm on this bus. I'm on these, uh, concert. I'm on these bus tools from her own out, bitch. That bitch said, put that picture on Instagram. I said, no, that's right, bitch. Um, that's all I got to say. Um, 